So we're just about two weeks into April and things are really kicking off. Um, April 11th is uh, tomorrow, considering it's gone past 12 o'clock now. And it's the 10th of April over here in the UK. Um, just a quick update regarding what's happened recently. Donald Trump ordered some uh, missile strikes on uh, Syria. <clears throat> this has been condemned by a number of countries, but also, you know, congratulated um, by a number of countries as well. Um, this happened while he was having a meeting with Xi Jinping, uh, the president of China. Um, it seems like every time Donald Trump is having a meeting with a foreign representative, something happens, like when he met the Japanese prime minister. Um, you know, North Korea did their missile launch. When he met Theresa May, it was the whole travel ban issue. Um, <clears throat> it seems like it keeps all these politicians on their toes when they come to visit him. Um, but back to the main issue... Um, Basically, the strikes that Donald Trump ordered has kind of, you know, kicked things off in a uh, not too good of a way because basically Russia is, um, you know, basically saying that the strikes have, you know, basically taken the US and Russia to the, the brink of a uh, military confrontation, um, seeing as uh, the uh, President Vladimir Putin's regime supports uh, Bashir Assad and um, the Syrian government it's become a little bit of a sticky situation um, uh, aside from that the US is you know I think antagonising North Korea by you know sending the Navy strike force to the Korean waters in response to the rogue nation's nuclear threat um, a while back in uh, December, there was an, a, a news story going around that a, a website called 38 North, which is a North Korean analyst website, had picked up some satellite imagery showing that um, the North Koreans were preparing a nuclear submarine for launch. They said it had either been recently been out to sea or was being prepared to go out to sea. <clears throat> that was in December. Um, I did a little bit of research on submarines and just to see how long they can stay underwater. You can see there's like three months, but that depends on the supply of food. Um, so if you can cram more than 90 days worth of food into your submarine, then you can stay underwater for longer, basically. It recycles the water and recycles the water for oxygen as well, so you can pretty much live under there. Some submarines um, can stay underwater for up to 25 years. I don't know who would want to stay underwater for that long, but I guess you would if the air above you was toxic. You could live in a submarine for 25 years until the atmosphere cleared itself up. Um, <clears throat> back to the satellite imagery that they were saying that they picked up in North Korea. So this happened in December. Um, I was keeping a close eye on this story because I thought if it's you know, a nuclear submarine and they're saying that it's possibly preparing for, for launch, then... You know, there might be some other news coverage, but there was no other news coverage after that. Um, my thoughts there are possibly that submarine may have slipped out somewhere in January. And, you know, currently whereabouts unknown. Um, not even being missed, not being looked for. Um, and three months before that news story is when North Korea successfully launched their first uh, SLBM. Uh, or SLBM, yeah, that's it, surface uh, submarine launched ballistic missile, missile. Um, maximum range of around a 1,000 kilometres, so, you know, not trying to read too much into it, but, you know, it's all kicking off um, at the moment. So, when I'm just reading these stories, I'm just thinking, you know, the times are looking like they're kind of now, and we need to make sure that we're prepared. You know, Russia warned that the uh, North Korea could attack the US with no nukes any day. And these experts have been saying that North Korea wouldn't have nukes for years. And, you know, according to this, I would suggest that it's already got nuclear weapons and could launch them at any time. <clears throat> 